Okay, so I received a new drawing tablet a few days ago, which is the Huion HS610, a simple tablet without a screen. And here is the unboxing and review. Before we begin, if you like my content, then please like and subscribe and keep notifications on so that you never miss a new upload. This is the unboxing, I forgot to film most of it. So, the tablet has really really good design. It has buttons on the left side and on the top row. These were very clicky and satisfying and you can map them easily to any shortcut or key you want. And now for the pen. Um, the pen has 8000 levels of pressure sensitivity and it comes in a, with a little holder which contains 8 spare nibs. Tablet surface is a nice, slightly textured quality. It feels quite good to draw on. And the thing that annoyed me the most was that my tablet got fingerprints way too easily. I've had it only for like a week and it was covered with my fingerprints. Moving on to the actual drawing. So, I am drawing an eye. The full version will be uploaded soon. I'm also using Medbank Paint, which is the software I made a video about last week. Link in the card above. I would like to say that the size of the tablet is perfect for drawing on any screen, whether you are drawing on a monitor, a computer, or a laptop. About the drawing itself, I'm drawing a pretty blue eye and I wasn't able to make very good eyelashes, so please excuse me. And that is the final drawing. Moving on to another category which is compatibility. The tablet is compatible with Windows and Mac OS and Android. So if you don't have a laptop or computer then you can even use an Android smartphone. The pen worked incredibly well and you don't even need to install any drivers. You get pressure sensitivity straight out of the box. And here is the drawing which I made on an app called Iris Paint X. Of course, the working area decreases, but that is expected. My final thoughts are, it, the tablet is very big, it's compatible with Android, it's the perfect size for any screen, it's good value, it's 
uh, 72 USD which is almost the same price as my older tablet which is much much smaller and it has a really good working area the only cons were that there were so many fingerprints and the scroll wheel was a bit bucky other than that the performance was amazing if you're looking to upgrade your drawing tablet from a small to big one or just starting out you can definitely check it out link to buy in the description thanks for watching hope you enjoyed leave a like and subscribe Write your ideas in the comments and stay tuned. Bye!